Hey guys, Andrew and Corey here from Mitt and Crate and Mike, the IT guy. We're down here at Eastern Market Brewing Company to taste some Michigan made hot sauces today. Got a collection of hot sauces from all over the state here. Something uh, for everybody, a little bit spicy, a little bit savory, some bacon flavor even. Uh, all of these are available on mittencrate.com along with a custom hot sauce gift box that we're putting together for the spice lover in your life. So check it out, mittencrate.com. And uh, you guys ready to try some hot sauces? Let's do it, man. So let's do it. Get into it. So we've got uh, Detroit Smoke <clears throat> Foodie Sauce here from Street Eats. It's gonna be a arduous process for me. I like to think I like hot sauces until it gets like <laughs> to be too hot, you know, and then you're just, <laughs> you can tell the face is red and you're sweating. That's super smoky. But it's really it's really mild. It's very almost mild like very it's mild. almost like a bar a barbecue sauce. It's yep. it's sweet, it's mild. Alright, so I say yeah, while we're on uh, while we're on street eats. Keep up the street eats train. Let's go with the uh, the three one three hot sauce here. Even if you're not a super spice lover, I feel like this is still perfect for pretty much anything. Oh yeah. That's good. Definitely a little bit definitely a little bit spicier than the last one. Oh yeah, it has a kick. It's super, it's like really tangy and yep. bright. Yep. I was gonna say tangy. So uh, the next one we have here is uh, Scotty O'Hotty's Beer Bacon Chipotle Hot Sauce. This is one of my all time personal favorites. This is, I don't know I if think you guys have had right. this one before, but <laughs> I could eat this shit on anything. My favorite thing that I put this on, I feel like it's burgers. Mm. Um, I feel it's like, it's you know, savory, umami, it's got a little bit of a kick. Burgers, and smoky I mean, chipotle it flavor. Tacos. Yeah, I feel like, like literally, I literally my anything. chip up. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's an easy no. go-to. Oh, it's so good. Mm, it's awesome. This is the Hellfire Detroit. This is the Manzana pepper. And so this is a pepper that is completely different for people that are you know, either into food or into hot sauce or whatever. They're actually just fire roasted peppers in a bottle. So a lot of the sauces are mixed with vinegar and stuff. This is just Manzana peppers. And for the, for unfortunately for later, this is all habanero. <laughs> <laughs> These aren't the hottest ones that they have, right? Yeah, they those have, are the two hottest. These are the two that hottest. And the, the great, hobbiner. great. All right, well, we're, go, <laughs> we're going for it. It's hot. It's not crazy hot, but it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just do it. Oh, oh, I'm going to start sweating. Oh, I can, right. I'm, already, I'm already sweating. This is habanero. What does it say in the back? For, this is under the yikes scale. And I'll tell you, when you put these on food, oh, it's nowhere near as hot. Like, it, it's just got great flavor. But when you're doing it on a chip like this, whew. That's, that's uh, just gonna dabble a little bit I'm on. I'm already starting to feel my face sweat. Yeah. <laughs> this, is the, this is the more mild one. Okay. The Ora <laughs> Solanis. <laughs> All right, and these are, these are pretty vinegary, so I wanna always shake these up. We only have to break here in a minute. All right. Oh, look, yeah. it's got like a perfect little dripper top. That's perfect. Great. Not too much. Great. You're going into a blind, huh? I'm just taking your word for it. Yeah, it's not that bad. I feel like it makes, <clears throat> The fact that we just had habanero hotter, but I mean that's probably like Tabasco level hot. Oh wow, yeah, it's got a good flavor. More vinegary, not uh, yeah. not as uh, not as uh, not as much texture as the other one, but definitely still a lot of heat on it. So this is holy matrimony, um, and this is going to be this is habanero pepper. I don't even oh just by the name. <laughs> Uh, I already know. Habanero, habanero, habanero pepper, and then it's uh, sweetened with carrot, so it does have a really cool flavor to it. Um, and again, this is a uh, vinegary-based hot sauces, so you want to shake these up. Um, the brinery stuff is uh, super big. I'm making all their stuff all natural. A lot of their produce is grown in Michigan. <laughs> there you go. Ooh, that is hot. Oh, I can smell it in the nostrils. <laughs> The thing is the nostrils. Yeah, and both both the, the brineries are both um, fermented hot sauces. That's why we're getting a little yeah, bit of that bubble action for the first there. time Whoa. that we're opening it. That was a really so they good ferment taste. the peppers. You can um, taste the carrot though. Yeah, it's it's yeah, it's not for being habanero, it's not crazy hot. The carrots do add a little bit of sweetness to it. But it's I mean, no joke, it's it's still hot. Yeah. This is uh, the Blee Blast. Barrel aged hot uh, sauce. Barrel aged hot sauce, hot pepper sauce. So it sounds hot. Um, if it's anything else like other blue products that we've had in the past, it's definitely going to be quality. I just don't know if it's. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what this is going to be like. This is going to. I've never had it. Oh, I'm, <laughs> getting a, nice. I'm getting the sniffles. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's hot. <laughs> 
Just breathe. I, I like this. This, I, this, is, this might going be going for another one. Yeah. This is Scotty Ohati. Um, same people who make the beer bacon chipotle, but this is their Reaper Del Muerte. Carolina Reaper pepper is one of the hottest peppers in the entire world, and they decided to make a hot sauce out of it. Um, some of the ingredients, Carolina Reaper peppers, kind of a little bit down there. Bujaloka, which some of you might know is ghost peppers. It's like a secondary ingredient. Um, they use hard cider and moonshine as their acid component in this. I mean, this is like the real deal. We're doing this because we love you guys. Oh, God. Holy cow. <laughs> That's too much. <laughs> I gotta like put this on another chip. That's, there's no way. I'm gonna I make can a do chip that. sandwich out of this one. <coughs> oh my god. It's I'm burning for, in the back of my throat. I'm waiting for the sting. Oh, that's hot. That wasn't as hot as I thought it was going to be. I don't think I, I, but it's definitely my lip. I can't feel my tongue. I can feel my lip sweating. Oh, <clears throat> I feel like underneath my tongue sweating. So what'd you guys think? Um, any favorites, any standouts? I think, I think for me, my favorite's probably going to be the, the blast sauce, the barrel aged sauce. It was, it was pretty good. Um, I mean, it had it had a lot of heat, but it was also I don't know, just very well rounded flavor. I think the barrel aging somehow mellowed out the sauce and gave it like this really huge kind of like umami flavor. Mike, what about you? I, I like the Hellfire. Those those two are excellent. It's got a lot of flavor. It's still got a lot of heat. I like that a it's just a, just roasted, it's, blended up peppers too. Yeah. I think that's kind of you, unique. You really that's get you really get the flavor of the peppers, and that's why I like it. I like. I don't like just hot to burn. I like the flavor of the hot sauce, and those two just give me the give me that flavor that I'm looking for. Yeah, you do get the full flavor of the yep. pepper. Well, my favorite, uh, you know, everybody probably knows, is the beer bacon chipotle. I'm not a huge hot sauce person, but this stuff is. I mean, put it on anything. It's uh, yeah, excellent. It's pretty burger. fantastic. Tacos, burgers on your chicken. Put it on eggs in the morning. Yeah. Hash browns. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's all around just flavorful just really unique. You can really taste like the bacon flavor in there. And so, I mean, it's won tons and tons of awards. One of my favorite, you know, products that we've ever put in Mitten Crate, but definitely uh, my favorite sauce. So there you have it. Uh, that's the smattering of Michigan hot sauces that we've tried for you today. Uh, hopefully you learned something and uh, check out mittencrate.com. Go to our website there. You can order any, all of these uh, in your own little bundles, or we have the, uh, the new hot sauce box available online with all of these and more. Uh, so check it out, mittencrate.com. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Cheers. We, we made it. We survived.